Hey Davis, this is Jordan Rodriguez with The Athletic. How are you? First of all, congratulations. Thank you, ma'am. I'm doing good. How are you? Doing well, thank you. Um, can you take us into what that call with Sean McVay, Les Snead, and uh, Nick Cayley was like just now? Uh, it, was, it was amazing. A dream come true. Um, you know, I, I'm just so thankful to, to have the opportunity to um, you know, be able to play for an organization for the Rams, you know, it's just the Rams are just such a high name, and you know, um, I'm just I'm just thankful. I couldn't be happier. What do you uh, What do you think skill set wise you bring to the uh, to the Rams? Um, I think I can do a little bit of both. Uh, I, no, I'm not afraid to put my hand in the dirt and and block whoever I'm asked to block. Um, I'm confident enough to to go up and, and catch the ball whenever it's thrown in my my uh, direction. Um, you know, I think there's a lot of room for improvement for me. Um, I think there always will be, um, but I do, you know, do think I can do a little bit of both. Speaking on that, uh, obviously tight ends in this particular system are asked to do so much so soon in their careers. Um, wondering if we could start with the with the blocking. How would you describe yourself as a blocker? Um, you know, I, I'd say I'm a, a solid blocker. Um, and I, like I said, I think there's room for improvement. But um, you know, I'm someone who tries to, to master technique and uh, you know just be a master of my craft. And um, like I said, I don't know if I'll ever master it, but uh, <laughs> I, I do. Uh, that's what I chase is to, to try to perfect uh, my technique in the blocking game. And then it, as a pass catcher, um, you know, a, as you've continued to develop your skills through through college, what are you maybe most proud of that you worked on to develop? And then what do you want to keep honing as you get to L.A.? Well, I, I, you know, I'm, I'm proud of how I, how I developed in both areas. Um, and uh, you know, I, the goal is to continue to improve. I think I need to improve in every aspect of my game, um, from a passing standpoint, just getting in and out of breaks and becoming as smooth of a route runner as I possibly can. And, and from a run game standpoint, just uh, like I said earlier, just trying to perfect my technique um, and, and be as efficient as I possibly can in that standpoint. Hey, Davis, this is Stu Jackson with TheRams.com. What's the celebration like right now? Who's, who's with you on the uh, on the big day today? Um, it's just my family, my, my brother and sister and their, their family, uh, and my, my fiance and um, her family, um, and then both my grandmothers and um, a couple of my high school coaches are here. That's awesome. How, how special is that to be able to – have kind of a, a small, I guess, or maybe not so small, but at least a close knit yeah. group like that, you know, with you. Yeah, uh, it's really special. You know, I, um, you know, they deserve as much of the credit as I do. I mean, they all, everyone here has had such a huge impact in my life, and they have helped me in so many ways uh, get to this point. And so, they deserve to be celebrated just as much, if not more, than me. Um, and so it's, it's definitely special. Davis, you're, you're a Tiger, but your dad was a Bulldog, and you grew up watching the Bulldogs, I know, in Georgia. What's it mean to come to a team where you're going to be playing with a couple of Georgia quarterbacks throwing you a lot of passes over the next couple of years? Yeah, no, that, that, it's, uh, it's awesome. Um, you know, I, I, uh, I was a Georgia fan growing up. You know, like you said, my dad played there. And, um, you know, I grew up watching – Matthew Stafford, and, um, you know, just to have the opportunity to, to play with him and to learn from him is uh, it's just it's unbelievable, and I'm super thankful. Had you uh, had you watched the Rams at all? I mean, I know they were in the stratosphere here a couple years ago, but had you watched them? And if so, what do you make of some of the skilled players? You know, Matthew, obviously, but Cooper Cup, and, and then on the other side of the ball, um, Aaron Donald. Yeah, no, I mean, I've always watched the Rams, um, and uh, I've always viewed, as, viewed the Rams as, you know, just a team that um, always had a chance to win the whole thing. You know, I feel like there's some teams that it might be a re rebuild season or, or something along those lines, but I just always felt like the Rams have always had the talent to, um, 
you know, run the table. And uh, you know, I'm, I'm just, like I said earlier, I'm just, I'm super thankful to be, be a part of this organization. All right. Well, thank you, Davis, and congrats again.